What's up guys, this is Helder from Digimon World Gamer and today we're gonna talk about Power Rangers Dino Fury Toys That's right, Power Rangers Dino Fury Toys They are coming this year, uh, someday <laughs> And today we're gonna talk about Battle Attackers The new line of Power Rangers Dino Fury Toys That come with two toys, that's very cool This is a double pack toys With the Red Ranger and some bad guy, Doomsnake which he, uh, which I don't know if it's the monster of the week, or if it's a general. Mm, kinda looks like the generic monster of the week, but I can be wrong. Uh, this toy has some action on the leg. I'm not sure, but for what we can see on the picture with the the hand on his leg, kinda looks like he, he has some kicking action on, on the leg, or... Something like that, I don't know, we have to wait and find out to see. And he has uh, an armor on his uh, on his left arm, I don't know exactly what it is. I don't know if it's part of the actual uh, Dino Fury uh, uniform, but it has some extra piece of armor, a golden piece of armor on his... Uh, arm, which is very cool. I don't know if it is a, if it is a power up or just a regular uh, Dino Fury uniform, but it looks very cool. He also comes with a uh, sword, which is very neat. It's very well painted. Finally, they're painting the Ranger weapons. <laughs> uh, it, it's very cool. I like the, how the Red Ranger looks. The the armor. The neat accessory. It also comes with a bad guy. That's very cool. They're making more bad guys for the Rangers. That's awesome. Uh, back in my day, when I was collecting Power Ranger toys, when I when I was a kid, I always wanted bad guys for the Power Rangers Lost Galaxy, and they didn't have a Trakina toy. That's very bad. They had the the pirate guy uh, villain toy, but they didn't have a Trakina toy. Even to this day, they don't have a a Turkina bad guy toy and even on Time Force they don't they have a Rensic toy but they don't have an Adira toy uh, I think they have a Frax toy but uh, just the two of it they, should, they could include an Adira too it would be very cool in my opinion uh, they could also make a on, Lost, on Lightspeed Rescue they could also make a Prince Olympus toy they didn't have they made a, a Diabolical and a Magmavor and that's it Two, only two villains for the whole show, not even Vipra, which was a very cool toy to have, or Lokai. Uh, they didn't uh, bother to make any monster for like Speed Rescue, and very little to Lost Gathers and Time War, which were my favorite seasons. But Hasbro is being kicked out and all out of villains. I saw with Beast Morpher they had lots of, of villain toys, that was very cool. And good to know they're gonna be making that with Dino Fury. We also have, besides the the Red Ranger, we have the Blue Ranger uh, battle attacker toy. He he, ha he comes with the sword, pretty much like the the Red Ranger. He has an extra golden piece on his uh, on his arm too, but it's different from the Red Ranger. He has some different rounded pattern. And for I can see, he is also a Triceratops. I'm not sure, but the three horns on, on his helmet kind of looks like Triceratops. He's a blue Triceratops Ranger, which is very cool. He also has a sword, and he comes with the bad guy Shockhorn, which is uh, a, guy, a bad guy that has a drill on his head, and his drill kind of looks like Dark Magician's top hat. <laughs> Maybe his evil Dark Magician cozy, I don't know. But look, it's it's very cool, this toy too, and I wish I could buy when it comes here to Brazil and make a review for you guys. But man, this looks very neat, and Hasbro is doing a good job. So, if you want to see more Power Ranger review, older stuff review, new stuff, uh, commentaries, leave it a comment in the description below, and I'll do what you guys want. See you next time!